Now, Martin Barnaby, the national chairman of uh, the uh, Trade Union of Nigeria Political Commission, has expressed concern about rising insecurity in Nigeria due to wrongly implemented policies of the ruling or progressive Congress, stating that uh, poverty is one of the indices of this growing insecurity. Nigeria is how better, based on the social contract between the ruling class and the citizens of this country. When you look at it, I think Nigerians are groaning. We can't breathe. And the only way we can breathe is to have people oriented economic policy that can bring about succor and relief to the citizens who have over the years, well, citizens have over the years not enjoy governance. Good governance. First, you have to build security infrastructure and also invest heavily on the providing food for the people because food is critical in this. I mean, addressing poverty. One of the major indices that leads to insecurity is poverty. The chairman of the Labour Party, Inquiry State, Ajibada Adekunle, alongside the Deputy National Secretary, Kendi Rotimi, has announced their intention to overthrow the ruling of Progressive Congress in the state in 2027. Come 2027 election in Kwara State, Labour Party is going to be strong and I'm very 100% sure of that we are taking over the affairs of government in Kwara State. And uh, by and large, uh, at the local government level, at world level, uh, we've put our house together. Presently, we have our ESCO in, in uh, almost all the wards in Kwara State now. So I believe there's room for a lot of improvement in Kwara State in terms of infrastructural development. The reduction in taxation, because uh, if the tax rate is high, we drive so many investors away from the state. So I want the governor, His Excellency, like here, uh, Malam Abraham Abrasak, to look at the issue of taxation in Nigeria, and especially in Kuala State, so that we don't drive away investors that are struggling to survive. By 2027, by the grace of the Almighty God, Labour Party will produce the second governor of Kuala State. We are bent on doing that, and we are committed. You can see at the national level, now why we are having so many crises. In